bright yellow, red, and orange, the leaves come down in hosts. The trees are Indian princes, but soon they'll turn to ghosts. Some would find fault with the morning red if they ever got up early enough. Perhaps the old monks were right when they tried to root love out. Perhaps the poets are right when they try to water it. It is a blood-red flower with the color of sin, but there's always the scent of a god about it. Only here and there an old sailor, drunk and asleep in his boots, catches tigers in red weather. In the pink light the small red sun goes rolling, rolling, round and round and round, at the same height in perpetual sunset. What is man, when you come to think upon him, but a minutely set, ingenious machine for turning, with infinite artfulness, the red wine of Shiraz into urine? The true colour of life is the colour of the body, the colour of the covered red, the implicit and not explicit red of the living heart and the pulses. It is the modest colour of the unpublished blood. Please, God, we're all right here. Please leave us alone. Don't send death in his fat red suit and his ho-ho baritone. Now wait a minute. You listen to me. I'm an advertising man, not a red herring. I've got a job, a secretary, a mother, two ex-wives, and several bartenders dependent on me, and I don't intend to disappoint them all by getting myself slightly killed. Red meat is not bad for you. Now blue-green meat, that's bad for you. Each month the blood sheets down like good red rain. It can be a fascinating game noticing how any person with vitality and vigor will have a little splash of red in a costume in a room or in a garden. Compared to Inspector Clouseau, Attila the Hun was a Red Cross volunteer. Poverty was an ornament on a learned man like a red ribbon on a white horse. Gossip is news running ahead of itself in a red satin dress. Artists can color the sky red because they know it's blue. Those of us who aren't artists must color things the way they are, or people might think we're stupid. Beauty to me is about being really comfortable in your own skin. That or a kick-ass red lipstick. Your cloak hides the sinner. Your cloak shields the lover. Color of wine, cyclamen, red rhododendron. And the angel in the gate, the flowering plum, dances like Italy, imagining red. On the breast of her gown, in fine red cloth, surrounded by elaborate embroidery and fantastic flourishes of gold thread, appeared the letter A. A blonde in a red dress can do without introductions, but not without a bodyguard. A good margarita, a good red wine, I like expensive alcohol, but not a lot of it. I don't like to throw up. My grandfather, Frank Lloyd Wright, wore a red sash on his wedding night. That is glamour. Red lips are not so red as the stained stones kissed by the English dead. I've always wanted to go to Switzerland to see what the army does with those wee red knives. Red is one of the strongest colours. It's blood. It has the power with the eye. That's why traffic lights are red, I guess, and stop signs as well. In fact, I use red in all my paintings. Tis said, as Cupid danced among the god, he down the nectar flung, which on the white rose being shed made it forever after red. The only advice I can give to aspiring writers is don't do it unless you're willing to give up your whole life to it. Red wine and garlic also helps. Red is the ultimate cure for sadness. 
Yes, sir, I'm a real southern boy. I've got a red neck, white socks, and blue ribbon beer. Ordering a man to write a poem is like commanding a pregnant woman to give birth to a red-headed child. The draft is white the draft is white people sending black people to fight yellow people to protect the country they stole from red people. Whenever you're sitting across from some important person, always picture him sitting there in a suit of long red underwear. That's the way I always operated in business. Our flag is red, white, and blue, but our nation is a rainbow. Red, yellow, brown, black, and white, and we're all precious in God's sight. Things that we do neath the red, white, and blue, though they can't be called happy or glorious, certainly keep us notorious. And must I wholly banish hence those these red and golden juices, and pay my vows of abstinence, that pallidest of muses? Look, the spangles that sleep all the year in a dark box, dreaming of being taken out and allowed to shine. The balls, the chains, red and gold, the fluffy threads. Put up your little arms and I'll give them all to you to hold. Ah, could they know how violets throw strange fire, red, red and purple and gold, how they glow, gold and purple and red, where her feet tread. The wind bit hard at Valley Forge one Christmas. Soldiers tied rags on their feet. Red footprints rode on the snow. Better dead than red. You can't be a red if you're married to a civil servant. <laughs>